Okay, Eric, here's a high voltage rectifier panel. Got the lips bent on it right here. So outside to outside is exactly 14 inches. So we got the uh, ohmite resistors here. We've got standoffs with the diodes. Um, I'm not sure how you want to connect uh, these, but in any case, um, one inch standoffs and uh, dominoes going on. Um, Swinging choke, We've got the high voltage uh, potential uh, transformer. We got the relay, and it actually touches the lip. I guess that's not gonna be a problem. The holes still seem to line up. Here's the uh, fuse holder, and then uh, this uh, cutoff switch is going to be coming out the front of the panel, and of course with the uh, handles. These are the handle holes. So. Um, there may be something else that goes in here. Um, I'm gonna have to discuss that with you, but this is uh, uh, what we got right here. High voltage terminal strips. Okay, so this is what what we need to um, cover. So anyway, this is the uh, setup so far. All right, Eric, here it is. Um, everything is sitting in place where it needs to be. Um, I just added the wire clips. I don't know what direction we turn them. But uh, if they're turned this way, then I have the grommets down at the bottom like that. So they come uh, straight down into the holes there into the chassis. And I think that's the only change since the last time you saw it. Um, little choke back here. Got the relay. Both these transformers, filament transformer, output plate, uh, plate resistor, setup, the tubes, the uh, grid plates. All three meters, got the switches, um, and then uh, underneath, I'll show you the meter multiplier resistor plate real quick. which is right there, right directly under here where the filament transformer goes and the output plate. So that's right there. And then I think the only other thing I need to do is put the uh, six, six and three terminal strip kind of equal spaced right here, the uh, barrier terminal strip, the through hole one or the second terminal is on the inside of the chassis. And I think that completes it, and I can take the uh, panel to get powder coated or whatever. Um, I'll do a count and replace all the fill, uh, Allen heads with uh, pan head screws. These lights, I think, have to be flipped. Switch goes there, and that's pretty much done. So it'll be the gray powder coat. And uh, if I can get the silk screen thing done in time, we'll have a separate place to do silk screen because that place doesn't. I'll do something else for the labels. So anyway. Take a look at that. Let me know uh, if anything else needs to be done. And if not, I'll disassemble it and get that ready for powder coating. And uh, next thing is I'll get the high voltage um, rectifier unit put together. All right.